hi guys hello it's Letta welcome back to my channel me and my journey with Jesus and I just wanted to read out of the book of Luke Luke 17 verse 20 all the way to oh boy verse 37 <laughs> um, I kind of feel like the Lord wanted me to read this um, it says, the coming of the kingdom. Um, now he was asked by the Pharisees when the kingdom of God would come. He answered them and said, the kingdom of God does not come with observation, nor will they say, see here or see there. For indeed, the kingdom of God is within you. Then he said to the disciples, the days will come when you will desire to see one of the days of the Son of Man, and you will not see it. And they will say to you, look here or look there, do not go after them or follow them. For as the light, for as the lightning that flashes out of one part under heaven shines to the other part under heaven, so also the Son of Man will be in his day. But first, he must suffer many things and be rejected by his generation, or by this generation. And as it was in the days of Noah, so it will be also in the days of the Son of Man. They ate, they drank, they married wives, they were given into marriage until the day that Noah entered the ark and the flood came and destroyed them all. Likewise, as it was also in the days of Lot, they ate, they drank, they bought, they sold, they planted, they built. But on the day that Lot went out of Sodom, it rained fire and brimstone from heaven and destroyed them all even so even so will it be in the day when the son of man is revealed and that day he who is on the housetop and his goods are in the house let him not come down to take them away and likewise, the one who is in the field, let him not turn back. Remember Lot's wife, whoever seeks to lose, whoever seeks to save his life will lose it. And whoever loses his life will preserve it. You know, there's a lot of people that in these last days, they're marrying, they're buying, they're selling, just like the Lord said they would. They're, you know, they're living their life. You know, even going to work, all those good things. Uh, some people, you got doomsday people out here that are actually stocking up because they know something bad's coming. So they think they're gonna be able to stock up all their goods and keep them to themselves and, and ride it out. Write it out hard. Unfortunately, stocking up on food, if that's what you want to do, go ahead. But I think the most important thing in these last days is to make sure your heart is right with the Lord, to make sure that you are ready for when he returns to make sure that you are living a repented saved life before him to make sure that your your heart is right with the lord um you can store up all the food you want but when you close your eyes when you close your eyes to fall asleep your soul's got to go somewhere where is it gonna go are you ready? Let me keep reading. Um, 
and, and the Lord says, uh, remember Lot's wife, whoever seeks to save his life will lose it, and whoever loses his life will preserve it. I tell you, in that night there will be two men in one bed. The one will be taken, and the other will be left. Two women will be grinding together out in the field, basically. The one will be taken, the other left. Two men will be in the field. The one will be taken, the other left. And they answered and said to him, Where, Lord? So he said to them, Wherever the body wherever the body is, there the eagles will be gathered together. We want to be ready in these last days. We want to be ready. We want to be ready for the Lord's coming. I'm excited. You know. Some of us are excited. Some people are scared. The Lord says, Whoa, be encouraged, for I have overcome the world. Jesus said these things are supposed to happen. Um, we're supposed to go through perilous times. Wars and rumors of wars and all of that. Come here. This is my little puppy. This is this is my, my son's dog. This is little man. Say hi. Yeah. Um, you know, Jesus is coming and the Lord wants us all to be ready and I want people to be ready too. So I'm going to be sharing, talking about my Lord and Savior. Huh. Yeah. And other things too. Blessings to y'all. And keep looking towards the sky. Jesus is coming. <laughs>